the snowstorm continued through the night with hurricane strength winds shaking our cabin. The next morning we woke up to snow covered windows and slightly calmer weather. It was still by no means calm, but the 50 miles per hour winds felt a lot more manageable than the 74 miles per hour we had a few hours earlier. The ocean was the stormiest I've ever seen it, with massive waves crashing against the coastline. Our cabin is located about 5 meters from the ocean as well as 5 meters up from the water level, so there's never an issue of the water reaching us, thankfully. And if you haven't been around here before, hello and welcome! My name is Cecilia and I live on Svalbard, an island close to the North Pole. And if you have been here before, welcome back! Oh wow! Oj, fönstren är helt täckta i köket. My gosh. Kan ni bara du se? Oj, havet. Wow, I think this is the biggest waves I've ever seen, boy. It's a storm day. Today is a storm day for us. Yeah. We can't go outside in this. Can we do kiss? I can't say. Oh, hey, I'm going to have to send you out here, okay? Into my ass? Um... Hmm. Deploy! Go! Go, 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 go! Go! Where'd you go? No! Go! Oh. Go! Hey, no! Where are you going to pee today then, huh? We're going to have to go out with you, I think. Come on, where did you sleep? Have you slept okay in this storm? Oh, baby boy. We were hit with one of the worst storms we've had in a while. But in true Svalbard fashion, a bad storm is just an opportunity to cozy up inside the cabin. On stormy days like these, the best thing is just to take it slow and enjoy some indoor time. The sound of a roaring storm outside and the crackle of a fire inside is my idea of a dream. I also have the luxury of working from home, which means that I can self-proclaim a snow day on days like these. Grim is a bit scared of snowstorms, mainly because when the wind hits the cabin, it makes a lot of noise, rattling and shaking. So that is what he finds scary. He doesn't mind it at all when he's actually outside in it. When he has to go to the bathroom, he just kind of runs right out into the storm. It's quite funny how he is seven years old and actually turning eight in April. I love it when we are out in town and people have come up to me and been like, wow, what a cute puppy. And I have to be like, thank you, he is seven. I love that about his personality though, that he's so energetic and just a tiny bit nuts. <laughs> if you've been around here for a while, you know that I'm a fan of video games and just games in general. I love to sit down with a coffee and just play something relaxing. I'm not very good at just doing nothing, so it is kind of the perfect way for me to just relax for a moment. And let me show you my latest obsession, which is Merch Gardens. It's the cutest, most calming game. Merch Gardens is a combination of merch and match three puzzle games. You have your own garden filled with flowers and wildlife, where the more you complete in the game, the more beautiful your garden becomes. 
If you get a kick out of collecting all sorts of different items in a game, this has you covered. There are hundreds of different items that can all be merged into beautiful grand decorations. There are also lots of cute wildlife creatures. I mean, just look at this little bird helping me with my gardening. There's a lot of games out there, but enjoying nature never gets tiring. I also really love when games give you new things and places to explore. Not only is there a massive collection of different items to discover, as well as your own garden space to unlock, there's different event camps too that give you even more new areas, things, and cute animals to find. Merge Gardens is perfect for when you need a relaxing moment, like for me during this snowstorm. I've been picking up the game here and there to play for a bit, either organizing my garden or just going through a few puzzle levels. I love it. You can download the game via the link in my description box or by scanning the QR code on the screen. And of course, it's totally free to play. Thank you so much to Merge Gardens for sponsoring today's video. Cody Cream. Are you okay? It's here. We are. Oh my god, I lost the knife. This is the. How do you sit, Dean? How do you sit? It's for the bedroom. So I ordered two things to actually finish the bedroom. And then after three weeks, they canceled one of the orders and just said, oh, we don't have it in stock, but it's in stock on the website. But one of the other things, which I didn't know. One of the other things did arrive. And this is the shelf unit. This was like 70 bucks. Grim, you're right in front of the camera, honey. You're <laughs> Grim also loves packages. It's the best thing he knows. Oh, is this for you? Is this a shelf for you? Your butthole is right in the if you just move this way. Oh, thank you. You set them hard. Oh, you're really an overhandler. It's a nice shelf. What do you think? Oh. It's super nice. Longyearbyen was feeling the storm as well, but since it's located in a valley with tall towering mountains around, it got slightly less wind than out here by our cabin. Which is good, because last time we had a big storm like this, the roof of the school flew off. <laughs> we are very well equipped generally for storms like these though. All of our power lines lay on the ground, which means that we rarely lose electricity. Cabins and apartment buildings are built with double or triple pane windows, which keeps both the heat in and keeps it from shattering. And like I said before, we generally don't have any snow days. We go to work and school in all weather.
Does somebody have a little extra energy after this snowstorm? Yeah, that's scary. Are you okay, sir? Yes, we're gonna go through that door, but okay. I just need to get dressed. Calm down. Now you can't take it. Come here. All the drama. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> we have a crazy boy. But ain't this now storm like that? It's a little bit difficult to talk to when you're wiggling around like this. Okay, come here. I just need to ask you a question. Grim, it ain't the snow storm längre. No, it's not. That means we can go and play outside. Come back into the frame, please. So oh, Lord. Okay, just get bit on. And then we go outside. Yeah, just aggressively play for a little bit. He got a new toy all the way from Australia and I cannot tell you how much he loves it. <laughs> Kangaroo. Oh, Demagova. The snowstorm has calmed down enough for us to be outside. Yes, and Grim is completely crazy. I think he's going stir crazy inside. So now we're gonna shovel some snow. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. It's a lot of snow here. It's pretty cool though. Look at this. There's so much. Is it hard? Oh, we need to get this in time. What a set. so nice to be able to like, I don't know, have a normal day. <laughs> what does it look like here? <laughs> Snowy! Oh my gosh! We're gonna take a shovel and we're gonna dig out my spark, my kick sled. And then we're gonna dig out this door here. There's not a lot left, but just to get that off the porch. And then we're gonna do the back of the house. So a good little workout. Never the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations Oh, cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong, I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel 
feel so free Oh my sweet baby It's very satisfying. It's the perfect snow now. So we're gonna get it before it gets super frozen or becomes super solid. I'm warm. It's not very cold out. Cause you glue all the pieces back together. Yeah, you you take all my wrongs and make them better. Yeah, you you're making me wanna try forever. Sweet baby, and I think to myself, and I'm thinking out loud. We want nothing else. That is pretty good. I think that was the no, we have this store as well. No, it's just uh, one windshield. <laughs> I mean, it's one wind windshield too much, I feel. <laughs> we shouldn't be losing one. But the wind turned around so fast. I found a casualty. Look! Grim, call ahead. Tita. It's an emergency. Get it out. Come here. Get out. Get out. What does that mean? Do you not want to get it out? Do you want me to get it out? Oh, he's alive! He's alive! What is so magical about February are the blue colors. What you're seeing is not the product of my camera or editing, it's what it actually looks like. Since the sun still hasn't come above the horizon, we get a long civil twilight, which colors our hours of daylight completely blue. I'm not sure we can really call it daylight since there is no sun, but you know what I mean. I find this time of year to be incredible. Generally, February tends to be a super cold month with temperatures well below minus 20 Celsius. But this year, it is more around minus five Celsius. and Very snowstormy, quite strange. But we're hoping for March to bring some really cold temperatures. I headed into the village to see what it looked like after the storm had settled. There seems to be no damage after this storm and the plow trucks are busy clearing all the streets from the snow. Longyearbyen is absolutely gorgeous when it's completely snow covered and the streetlights shine bright against the dark blue hues. There is so much snow everywhere. But I don't think there's been any damage. I haven't heard anything. And you can see all of the tractors and everything working so hard to remove all of the snow. I mean, look at this. Can you see how big that is? It's like three times the size of me. Oh, here comes a bus. But it's so beautiful. So much snow everywhere. That's the airport bus. We don't have any communal transport, but we only have the airport bus. It's so beautiful. It's starting to get cold, which is great because that means the snow is going to stay. It's gorgeous.
you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out our Patreon if you want to see more content from us. And also head to the link in my description to download the super cute game Merge Gardens. I will see you guys next week. Have an amazing day. Okay, bye!